I ran some errands and I took a shower, but before I did, I did use this Real Barrier Cleansing Oil Balm to remove all of my makeup. I think of all the products in both of these skincare routines, this has got to be my favorite. It has this really cool three-step transforming texture from oil balm to milk to a moisturizing pack. So basically, you would just apply this onto your dry skin as you would any other oil cleanser. And it has, I don't know, maybe like a similar texture to coconut oil when it's like at its hardened state, if that makes sense. And you just rub it in and it will just slowly melt all of your makeup off. And once it comes into contact with water, it turns into this milky texture that rinses off really nicely. And it just leaves your skin feeling so hydrated. It's insane, I love it. And what's great is that this product is formulated without the use of silicone or mineral oil, which could be really bad for you. If you're like me and you're pretty anal about making sure all of your makeup is off, you can double cleanse using the cream cleanser foam from the morning routine that I showed you earlier. Um, I just like to double cleanse because it makes me feel better. <laughs> And then I'm gonna use the Real Barrier Essence Mist again. Like I mentioned, I use this as a toner, so I do it both morning and night. And I just spritz it all over my face. I swear, that feels so nice. <laughs> I just wanna carry this with me at all times and just do that all the time. The next step is, of course, a mask. You can't do a skincare routine without a mask. At least I can't. I use a mask every single night. Um, this is the Real Barrier Extreme Cream Mask. This mask is soaked in rich essence of their top selling Real Barrier Extreme Cream, which I'm gonna show you in a bit because it's actually the stuff that follows this one. But I love this mask because it makes my skin appear a lot firmer and a lot more plumped and just supple. But it's just a super fine microfiber mask. One side is actually softer and the other side is the microfiber side. I don't know which side is the correct side but I usually use the soft side this fits my face so well unlike other masks that I've used before so it makes it a lot more comfortable and I make sure to apply the product onto my neck and also my body but yeah, I usually wait for 15 minutes before I take this off, so I will be right back. All right, so it's been 15 minutes, so I'm gonna take that off, and my skin just feels so nice. Just gently pat that product into my skin some more. The next product is the Real Barrier Extreme Cream, which is the best selling product from Real Barrier. Like I mentioned earlier, it's clinically proven to hydrate your skin for 72 hours, which is amazing. I just take a little bit. I know I should be using that scoop thing, but. And I dot it all over my face. And this product has a bouncy texture that restores the skin's firmness and elasticity. This is usually the night skincare routine, but I wanted to add one last product, and it is the Real Barrier Seeker Relief Cream. This is a special calming cream that's formulated with high concentrates of well-known soothing agents. It's great for those monthly breakouts, or using after a minor dermatological procedure, or even when your skin's been exposed to the cold or the sun. I've been using it on my breakouts, and what I do is I just apply a small amount on my affected areas, and I find that it does minimize it by the next morning, so I really do like that. But that is it for both of my morning and night skincare routine. If you are looking for hydrating products, I would totally recommend this. In case you are interested, I did link them down in the description box. But other than that, I will see you in the next video. Bye!